any story. Do you know the story of Dumbo? Come on, I'll tell you on the way. circus and his ears are so big that everyone teases him. Then one day he realizes that his big ears are what makes him special. He can use them to fly. That's why Honest. they call him Dumbo the Flying Elf. Villains and villainesses, please give a nasty cold welcome to Dumbo the Falling Elf. I certainly don't remember the circus tent looking this way, but I guess that's what happens when a bunch of clowns take over. Say, Mrs. Jumbo, why the long trunk? Because tonight the audience is filled with villains who just laugh at the most dreadful things. And worst of all, Dumbo can't fly anymore, but the clowns keep forcing him to do his high dive act just so they can keep the audience entertained. Don't worry, Mrs. Jumbo. My friend here is a pretty talented character. We'll find a way to save Dumbo. We just need you to give us a lift. Start by making the clown with the paddle hit the other clown instead of Dumbo. Hey, that looks like a good angle for the cannon. That fireman clown doesn't exactly look like a trapeze artist, but he's our best bet. Looks like a good angle for the cannon. <laughs> you know, you should put the beach ball where Bumpy keeps crashing, right in the middle of the race. Now make Drop sure everything elephant. is set where you want it before you make Bumpy jump again. <laughs> Hey, that looks like a good angle for the cannon. The water actually made that clown fly up in the air. You did it! You saved Dumbo! And not a minute too soon for Bumpy. Must be doing something right. Dumbo can fly again. Let's get back to the storybook and make sure he finds his mother. Isn't that sweet? There's nothing stronger than the bond between a mother and her child, especially if they're both elephants. <laughs> two stories down and two to go. What's next?